I don't need it. I don't need it. I won't use it. I won't use it. Will I buy it? You see this? It is this on the palette. Well, hello, my lovely Neslings, and welcome to another new makeup releases. This is a recurring series on my channel every Saturday where I go over new makeup releases, sneak peeks, but not only makeup, because I am incorporating other things than makeup as well in these and you guys really seem to like them and if you are new welcome my name is nikki i'm 45 from the netherlands hence the accent and if you love makeup commentary if you want to be uh, inspired by unusual color combinations if you hear want to hear about brands that no one is talking about and if you want to be entertained then this is the channel for you subscribe now become part of my nestlings because we are having a blast here on the internet i forgot to mention that i'm slightly orcish didn't i which basically means olive what i have on my eyeballs is this beauty which is so me so my aesthetic i am doing a multiple looks video with this and this is the second look and the video should go online next week uh, that's the plan. The plan is also five looks to give you some inspiration. And just because I want to do more looks with this palette because it's just me. Yes. Let me go to the side. <laughs> I, I, I want to say something, but I don't remember what. So let's start with what. I, no, let's start with what I have. I have so I have some things here that are so, so cutesy. So let's start with that. Let's start with these. This is from uh, Hontor Art. Hontor? Hontor. I think Hontor Art. I don't know how to pronounce that. I'm very, very sorry. But this is, oh, this is so cute. So you see here a chubby dragon. A chub, chubby dragon cub with flowery bits uh, and a whole whole baby world on his back. And it's just so cute. And the other thing that you see is one um, it's one of the spirits of the future Christmas. And it's just so stunning. So these are uh, sculptures, uh, stones, painted. It's I don't exactly know what it is. But it's so, so pretty. So I will leave the site where you can find these down below. These will make amazing gifts, especially now. Yes, the next brand that I'm going to mention, I have been subscribed to her on Instagram for quite some time, and I'm just going to mention this. And this is Balambeshka. I hope I pronounced that right. If I'm not mistaken, she's Russian, and she makes these. She makes bumblebees. She makes moths. She makes... Oh, and they are... I think they're brooches, and they are of... I, I believe they're clay. Let's see. Uh, polymer clay. Yeah. I don't know when. I am going to order one of these, but I don't know when. But they are just, they are so, so stunning. They're just so stunning. So yeah, I will leave her site down below as well. She has an Etsy shop, but I will also leave her Instagram handle down below because her Etsy shop, I think, only updates once every few weeks or once a month. So I will leave her Instagram down below so uh, so you can check her out. It's just... <laughs> wow. The next one I actually got sent in DM by one of you, and this is Wickedly Me Boutique. This is basically witchy, witchy stuff, uh, pendants, rings, all that jazz, uh, especially bigger pieces because that is really what she likes to do. Um, this, the pieces that she that she's making are stunning. It's not necessarily for me because I I do like bigger pieces, but not always. Ring wise, I, if I have a very, very big ring, for instance, it it's not really me. What I do like are those uh, that you see here. So these are the protection locket pendants. Um, they are, well, lockets that you can put something in and then you can hang around your neck. And that's what I really, really do like. I will leave her site down below. I think it's also an Etsy, an Etsy shop. I will leave it down below for you to check out. If you like this type of stuff. Go 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 check her out. Uh, and now, yeah, now I'm going to go to the basically regular brands or something. Let's start with 
perfume. Let's start with this from KKW Fragrance. This is the Opals collection. It includes three fragrances. Opal Mood, which is fruity floral. Uh, Opal Drip, which is gourmand woody. Um, then Opal Energy, which is floral woody. And you can only get them as a bundle uh, for 120 bucks. It's available already. I do like the way that these are looking. I just don't like the fact that you can only get them in a bundle. I, I don't know. I, I, I was kind of like, yeah, again, I like how these are looking. Um, they are, I think someone, was it Teresa who compared these to, an, or was it Audra who compared these to one of those egg, egg things that make most women happy? I see a pebble. That's what I see. Uh, and, and I think that they are just made to lie down on your vanity. Yeah, they, they look pretty, but I, I don't want all three. I would want Opal Drip, I think. I think that's the only one that I would really want. Although Lemon and Ginger, that sounds very interesting. Maybe I would like the Opal Energy as well, but the Opal Mood, I don't think would be for me. Maybe I'm mistaken. I don't really know. I thought I had an opinion on this, but apparently I don't. Not anymore. Maybe I've spent all my bitchiness of today. I don't know. Let me know your thoughts. Have you gotten these? How are they? If you have, let me know down below. Let's next go to an update. Uh, last week I mentioned there was another collab between uh, Catrice and Essence. There uh, an, another sister collab. Uh, and it was Disney inspired. Here I have a picture. Uh, it is... Uh, last week I linked Cosmetic for Less because it was available there. I don't know if it's available... Um, where uh, Did I see it also on Boozy Shop? Could be. Um, as far as I know, this is only available in Europe. Yes, but uh, I have a picture of the collection here. So basically Essence is the... Yeah, so the black packaging is the part from Essence and the gold packaging is the part from Catrice. And they have um, some things... They have eyeshadow palettes, they have mascaras, brushes... Uh, primer, oils, highlighters, I think. Um, I, I kind of want to see this in person. Because the, sometimes it is more colorful than you think it is. Other times I'm like, it's a little bit more muted than I think it is. I honestly like the color stories of uh, Essence a little bit better than the ones from Catrice. But that's me. I, I don't know if we will get these in store. I actually have no idea. But I do think it is a fun collection. And it looks pretty. Let me know if you've gotten anything from the collection. Uh, the next thing that I have here is from Essence. I think I saw this online at Boozy Shop already. This is the It's a Kind of Magic a Wish Upon a Star Trend Edition. Um, this is part of it though. Because there will be more coming our way if i'm not mistaken this is also for europe i think this is their holiday collection yeah with a freaking blue but i i understand that if it's wishing wishing upon a star i get the blue for the rest it's not really drawing me in that much for what i see here but it's probably we're probably going to get this in store because we usually get the trend editions in store I always like to see things like that in person. Um, but maybe you have already gotten this. Let me know down below. I, I do usually like the um, the quality of the trend editions. I really like. At least the things that I have tried. I think it's very nice quality. Let's next go to uh, Likely Makeup. Because this is the Ugly palette. It is available now. Um, for 29 bucks. Um, I thought I had more pictures well apparently not uh this is a combination of mattes and shimmers and it's a very fun bright palette i like the shimmers that they chose um i actually like the fact that they have a blue matte in the same color as the blue shimmer i think that's fun yeah i like this i think it's their first eyeshadow palettes if i'm not mistaken right is it i think so it's 12 shades Eight mattes, four shimmers. I am actually not sure if it is their first eyeshadow palette. I, I know them for their um, funky blush palettes. That's what I know them for. Have you tried this already? Or have you ordered it? Let me know. I think it looks fun. 
Yes, it does. Let's next go to Colourpop. Uh, because I have a few things from Colourpop. I have... What was this again? Oh yeah, the some of the 2021 vaults for basically the holiday season. Um, I have a bestie in show. I think those were the lippy sticks. We have some, I think some eyeshadow... Eyeshadows in a bundle. Basically, there's a bunch in a bundle. Lipstick fault, yeah. There will be eyeshadow bundles, probably. Lippy pencils in bundles. Uh, maybe cheek products in bundles. Soul body bundle things. Yeah. If you like stuff like this, then this will be for you. For me, I usually, I usually don't go for bundles like this. Because for me, usually the colors that are in the bundles, I'm like, yeah, but I, I only want maybe two or three. So if you are like me and you only want two or three, then don't buy it in a bundle, even though it will save you money. Uh, because honestly, at the end of the day, it will cost you more because there will be a bunch of stuff in there that you don't use. That you basically have to give away or throw away, you know? And that's, I think, kind of a shame. I do like sets, though. Um... Especially if they are like minis that you can try stuff. But if uh, a set is only worth it if you want to use most of it. If not all of it. So yeah, but I, there are some sets in here. I don't know. I, I, I'm not excited about this. I, I cannot help it. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just not excited about this. And the next thing that I'm going to mention is their <sighs> Rudolph collection. Now... As a holiday collection goes, I think this is a fun collection. I think it is a very fun Christmassy theme. There are things in here that I'm like, yeah, that's very, very fun. That's very fun. Uh, if it was, um, if, if I could get Colourpop here in store, I probably would have bought some things from this because I think it's fun. I think it will be fun to gift as well. As it stands, I think it looks cute, um, but that's about it. Yeah, you know, it's, I think that a lot of people will go bonkers for this. For me, I'm like, eh, the, the, the trouble is though that if I then see Amanda swatches, I'm like, yeah, it does look very, very pretty. But when I see this, I also have this. Yeah, that's basically it. I think there are fun elements, but yeah, it's another Colourpop collection. What can I say? But it does look cute. It does look cute. I love reindeer. I love reindeer. So, so uh, They're actually an amazing animal. Do you know that? They are an amazing, truly an amazing animal. Um, but, yeah. Yeah. No. Let's go to the... I don't know. Maybe I'm tired. I don't know what it is. But I'm just not that excited about it. I think it's cute, but... Yeah, that's kind of it. Uh, let's go next to uh, Camarillo Beauty. Um, this is the Taking My Power Back eyeshadow palette. It's 12 mattes, uh, no, 12 shades, 7 mattes, 5 shimmers. It says here, Taking My Power Back is a palette that's all about rising and stepping into your power. It is believed that colors are tools for expression and healing. And that is what this palette is all about. It's available November the 22nd. And I love that. I love the message behind this. I love the fact taking, taking back your power. I love that. A lot. And I agree with the number of times that I hear from you guys that... I make you feel that you can smear anything on your eyeballs and that you were kind of afraid to do that before. I cannot tell you how many of those comments I get. And I understand it because I felt the same way. Colors make us feel a certain way. Also smells uh, make us feel a certain way. And you can really, really express yourself with color. And every don't forget though, everything is a color. A neutral is also a color. This, which is a pretty... For me, it's a very neutral look. But it's a green look for someone else. But for my skin, it's this is my kind of neutral look. You know? I don't know the brand. Let me know if you do. Um, but when I saw this, I was like... I, wanted to, I want to talk about this. Because I think this is an amazing message. Yes. And I hope the palette will be a huge success. Let's go next to uh, Auric. Glow by Auric. Because these are... New smoke reflects. You got an olive green. 
I don't need it. I don't need it. I won't use it. I won't use it. A cranberry red. There are 39 bucks a peach or a, a piece or 78 for the duo. They are available now. This is very much her. The way that she does her eyeshadow, it is not mine. But looking at this, I'm like, I want it. I, I don't need it. I won't buy it because I won't use it. But I still am like, I want it. <laughs> That's how pretty this looks. Yeah, what can I say? It looks stunning. Have you tried these? I have heard great things. And if this was something that I know I would use, I would try these. I would buy these. But I know I won't. I know I won't. So I'm not going to. <laughs> I'm not going to. Because I know I won't use them. And then it's just... Then it's just a waste, you know, because they will... No, I know. But let me know if you've tried them. Let me know. I know that they will be amazeballs because I have heard great things about this. But yeah, <sighs> I don't need them. No, I don't. Let, let's go to the next thing, which is from Alien Cosmetics. Last week I mentioned a uh, Nook collection that she was sneaking And also some new things that she was sneaking. And I said, I think it's kind of eyeshadows or lippies. And it is liquid eyeshadows. You see them here. These are the Lucent liquid eyeshadows. There will be five shades. They are $12.50 um, bucks a peach. A piece. Apparently there's something wrong with peaches today. They are vegan and the net weight of them is 3.8 grams. For this item... The co codes are not applicable, uh, but you, you can still use a code uh, for other things. So I have an affiliate code, which is Nikki Raven, um, but apparently it does not work on these items. I don't really know why exactly, but yeah, there it's not. Um, is it available already or is this coming? I actually, let me see. Yeah. Oh, and her shimmer base gel is online as well. Oh, I mentioned that a few weeks back, I believe. But the shimmer base gel is online as well for six bucks. And the lucid eyeshadows are online uh, as well. Yeah. Also, the poison apple is in stock and the hauntingly glamorous is in stock. So that is that is what is on her site currently. She's still in the middle of her move. And uh, yeah, and her rebrand. So if you want these... Go and grab them now. Because they are they are online. Yeah, they look stunning. What can I say? They look stunning. Yeah, let me know your thoughts. Have you tried these? Let me know. I am not going to buy these because I'm actually not sure if I if they are on the way in PR. I know there's PR coming, but I don't exactly know what. So that's a surprise for me as well. Uh, let's next go to uh, Kurt. Cosmetics, because this is uh, the nightmare, uh, the Christmas, the Krampus <laughs> Christmas nightmare collection. The complete collection is say seven, uh, 67 bucks. I always have to think. Um, then the palette is nine pens, uh, shimmers, glitters, and mattes for 25. And then the shimmer lip gloss uh, potions are in. One, two, three shades. They are 17 bucks each. And there's also a Twisted Peppermint Soap for four. I think that the color story is fun. But yeah, press glitters. It's not... I don't use press glitters. I don't. Um, so... Yeah, but I know that a lot of you still love press glitters a lot. I do think that the color story is very nice and Christmassy. And what can I say? I love Krampus. I love that uh, the mythology behind it. It is not something that is celebrated here in the Netherlands, but it is still celebrated in Germany. And um, also the promo pictures that Krampus outfit is so cool. Yeah, I hope this will be a huge success. I think that the color story is fun. I think it embodies Krampus and Christmas and... Yeah, let me know your thoughts. Have you tried this? Have you ordered it? Uh, it's online already, right? Yeah, it is now available. You can use code EARTH, uh, which is not my code, but it is from someone else to save some money. So yeah, I will link it down below. Let's next go to uh, LMR Cosmetics. Yeah, Oh yeah, this is a collection that I really, really like. So this is, um, they are launching 13 brand new products in collaboration with uh, Encanto movie 
Am I pronouncing that correctly? Encanto? I don't know. Um, and it's their largest launch ever. They are on honored to create a dynamic collection of beauty products designed to celebrate the magic of Disney's uh, Encanto with colors seen in the movie. You can actually swatch, touch and wear. That's so, so cool. Now, I, I was like, what Disney movie? And when I looked it up um, on Instagram, I was like, oh, yeah, I saw sneak peeks of that. And I think... If that one comes to Disney Plus, I'm going to watch it because it looks so, such a funky, cool and fun movie. Honestly, in this collection, this is a Disney collection. Guys, when I look at this, I get happy to look at this. I get so, so happy to look at this. I can feel when I see um, the pictures of the movie... I can see this. And it's the same kind of uh, feeling that I got with Beauty Base Disney collab. Their colors are more muted because they are working with the old school um, movies, animated movies. But this is, honestly, I would love to try stuff from this. When I, when I see this, the complete vibe of the collection, I get inspired. I get happy. I... <sighs> It's also the very first time that I'm truly looking at the picture of the complete collection. And I'm like... <gasps> mm. Anyway, you get um, their first 10-pan palette. Uh, yeah. A holographic high shine highlighter. Two new powder blushes. Uh, two uh, longwear lip glosses, two lip liners, two new spread your wings liquid liners, an emerald eterno and a lilac sin limit. Oh, I cannot speak. I'm sorry. One complexion brush, uh, an eye brush trio, a handheld foldable mirror. It's a foldable mirror? Really? That is very, very cutesy. It's only in theaters, really. I hope it comes to Disney Plus though, because I really want to see that movie. This is such a fun collection. I get so, so happy when I see this collection. I don't even know if it is available. I don't even know if I could get my hands on it. I think that they ship internationally, right? Elamar Cosmetics, is it, does, I don't know if it has a reseller, uh, but I will link down below where you can find it. I think this looks so, so stunning. Yeah, honestly. Let's go next to Lethal Cosmetics. Because they are going to do something big. Now, they are revealing it today as you are watching this. At 1pm uh, CET. Uh, that means that it is already revealed when you are watching this. Because this is set to go online at 5pm CET. So, I have also seen it. If everything goes well. I don't know what it is. But I'm interested. I, th I think actually... It is going to be duochromes or multi-chrome bundle because they have kind of sneaked some multi-chrome shades. They have one in their Berlin palette, which is, can I say, just stunning. Um, we will probably talk about this again next week. Yeah, that's it. We will probably talk about it again next week because then I know what it is. And right now, as I'm filming this, I don't know. And don't forget about their Black Friday deals because if I'm not mistaken, their Black Friday deals will be very, very well. And I don't know if it's currently going on already or if it is from next week but i will list, i will link it down below um go check out their site and if there is any brand that you want deals from go to their sites to see if they have a black friday deal and other you know bigger retailers for instance like beauty bay um they have black friday deals going on already so if you want to know black friday deals for your favorite brands go check out the websites from the brands because usually they have very very nice black friday deals for instance uh, desiem has uh, the complete month of november what was it 20 percent off i believe so just go to their own site let's go next to copacetic cosmetics because this is so this is so fun. Uh, these are two new lippies. Uh, you get uh, Judicious, which is a tutti frutti marshmallow flavored shimmery peach lip gloss, and Dauntless, which is a metallic olive liquid lipstick. Yeah. So you can get um, a cutie box with one mini sized and a comfort. I don't understand that part though. Um, but yeah. 
that that gloss looks very very pretty. The, I love an orangey gloss, and I, that that metallic olive liquid lipstick I find so interesting. Would I wear the ton? Probably not. But I I now understand also why a green liquid lipstick looks a specific kind of green. Granted, a warmer green liquid lipstick looks very flattering on me. Uh, because yeah, it, it goes well with my complexion. So yeah, I think this is very, very fun. And when I saw that, I, I knew I wanted to mention it. Okay, let's go next to... What is this? What was this? Uh, oh yeah, J-Lo Beauty. Because J-Lo Beauty... The weird thing is, I mentioned that J-Lo... I know I mentioned that J-Lo Beauty was starting a while back. I actually don't know if I mentioned the brand after that. Because I kind of forgot about them. But yeah, they have released... I think it was skincare that she released. If I'm not mistaken. Maybe I am. I don't know. But this round, it is brushes. So it's new glowing skin brush set. It's six brushes. It's limited edition. It's available now for 75 bucks. Is that a bad price? I think it is. It's on the higher end. And yes, there are cheaper brush sets out there. Um, but it could also be worse. You know, um, it's, I think, skincare brushes, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, you get also get a free bag. I think it's more skincare brushes looking at this, which is very interesting. Or maybe I am mistaken, but that's kind of what it looks like here on the picture. So let me know. Have you tried it? It's available now. Uh, yeah. And I wanted to mention it. I don't know why, but I, I found it interesting, so I wanted to talk about it. It's nothing for it's not something for me though. Um, I like to do skincare with my fingers, unless it's a clay mask, because there is just something about a clay mask, putting it on with my fingers. I don't like that at all. So that's why I use a mask brush. That's the only reason when I when I use a mask brush or a brush for my skincare. For the rest, I like to use my fingers. Yes. Let's next go to uh, Paul and Joe Beauty because they are releasing their Christmas collection. You get a silk hand cream, a moisturizing hand cream, a treatment lipsticks and limited lipsticks and a mirror. It's available already for pre-order. The cats have hats. It's a cat in a hat. <sighs> Yeah, the hand creams, I, I, they're cute to see, but it's a cat in a hat. <laughs> what can I say? It's a cat in a hat. Can I get Paul and Joe at Beauty Bay? I am actually not sure. I think so. <sighs> yeah, the mirror is cute, but it's a, it's a freaking cat. In, there's an orange cat in a hat. <sighs> I want it. <laughs> Will I use it? Maybe once on the side to try. It's a freaking cat in a hat. Oh. I tried. I tried to put a, a Santa hat on my ginger cat. He was not amused. At all. So. Yeah. Sue me. Will I buy it? If it is on Beauty Bay, I'm, I'm going to make a Beauty Bay order um, really soon because my bestie needs a new foundation. Uh, and if this is there, do I need to finish the sentence? <laughs> yeah, never mind. Let's go. Let's go to the next one, which is from It's Bell Cosmetics. Um, this is available already as well. Uh, the limit is one palette per customer per order. Uh, separate orders won't be accepted. If you fail to follow this, you will receive a store credit. Okay, yeah. Um, the palette will retail for 45 bucks. The cost is based on the full door chromes. Yeah, door chromes are expensive. That's just the way it is. But this is their newest palette, Dawn of Fall. And it is, it's stunning. It's not something that I will uh, use often. Uh, as I've said on numerous occasions, I am not one for an all shimmer palette, but this is stunning. I have heard very good things about the formula. It is online already. I will link it down below. I don't know if it is sold out or not, but I will still link it because it does look stunning. Um, yeah, what can I say? It looks stunning. Let me know if you've gotten it. Have you? 
Um, let me know down below. Oh yeah, oh yeah. I'm... I'm a little bit angry with this next brand. And that is Barry M. I will show you the picture. This is their new wildlife collection. The collection includes three new eyeshadow palettes. 20% of the net profits are being donated to PTES to raise awareness for endangered species in the UK, especially. I want the bumblebee. I also would like the beetle, but I want that bumblebee. I went on the Barry M site, which is in the UK. I put the Bumblebee palette in my cart. I put two other things in my cart. I cannot buy it. They will not ship it out. They will not ship it to me. So I'm so sad. I think that it will come to... Was it look fantastic? Because when I search the palette... Stop it! Je kan er gewoon uit, joh, Zulkaus. When I, when I searched the palette, there was a site that came... I think it was Look Fantastic that came... One of my cats is trying to get outside. The window is open, so he can. He's just being a little bastard. So I hope it will come... If, if, if I can get this, I am going to. Is it a neutral color story? Yes, but I don't care. There's a bumblebee on it. You see this? It is this on the palette. I need it. It was eight pounds... Um, so if it comes here to the Netherlands, uh, if I can get my grubby little hands on this, I, I am going to buy it. Will I use it? Maybe, maybe not. I don't care. I want it. And I think it's an amazing cause as well. Uh, let's next go to... Oh yeah, this is actually also an update from uh, Dandelions Co. Last week I mentioned um, their uh, winter bundle. Here you see the full bundle. It's the snow spell eyeshadow palette, but you can, also, you can buy it as a bundle without the palette and you can buy it with the palette. It's 12 shades, 7 mattes, 5 shimmers. Uh, the shadows are 450 bucks each because you can also buy them separately. The bundle price for the 12 shadows is 40. And the palette price is 50. Uh, it is available um, today, no, yesterday, Friday the 19th, it was available. This is a very, very pretty color story. I like that they have done the gray scale with the gray and basically a little bit more of the gray blue scale and then some of the autumn colors as well. I really, really like this. I think it is a stunning bundle. This is a brand and I am compiling my list of brands that I want to try next year and this brand is on it. Um, yeah, this looks stunning. This looks stunning. And even though it's technically singles, because it is sold as a bundle, I'm like... I can vibe with that because in my mind then it's still a palette. Don't ask. I don't know. So yeah, let me know if you have ordered this. Um, let me know if you've tried them. I have heard good things about Dandelions. Again, I am going to try them next year for sure. Um, next, oh yeah. next, I'm going to go to this from Morphe. And this is with Pony's makeup. Now I was like, why do I know Pony? Why do I know that girl? And I remember I watched Queer Eye and they went, they had a Queer Eye in Japan, if I'm not mistaken, where they worked with her. And I like her. I don't follow her, but I do like her. Uh, the Constellation Sky Artistry Palette is 36 bucks. Uh, then you get a Lip Jelly Trio for 20. Um, and then Face and Body Embellishments. It's online already. And there are, uh, it's also online on Morphe. It's online at Alta. Now, What I remember from her from that show is that these are her colors. I, if I'm not, yeah, I remember her loving purple. Now there's purple in here. There are some neutral shades in here. I'm not hating the color story. I just think it could be way, way smaller. And why? Because looking at this, um, I think that there are shades in here that don't need to be in here. I think they could have made this smaller. I think they could have curated this down a bunch. Um, but that's me. I do think that the outside reflects the inside. It's it's a half colorful, half neutral palette. That's how I see it, at least at least in this picture. And then the lippy, the lippy jellies. I don't I don't know what that means. Is it a lip balm? I don't know. Yeah, it looks fun. It looks fun. I have seen people who are very very excited about this. I have seen people who are not. I am in the middle. I am kind of meh. I like some of the colors that are in here. I like I like the look of the collection. 
Um, but it's basically just a big ass Morphe palette. I hope that the quality is good. So let's just say that. But yeah, maybe you are over the moon. Pun actually not intended, but appreciated nonetheless. By me, that is. Let me know your thoughts. What do you think? Have you gotten it? Are you excited? Let me know. Let's next go to... How long have I been filming for? Okay. Let's next go to... No. Uh, notoriously Morbid. Um, they are releasing uh, new products for Black Friday. Black Friday. And this is the Naughty Eyeshadow Palette. It contains 12 shades. 3 multi-chromes. 1 do... One multi-chrome flake shimmer. Uh, two duochrome shimmers with multi-chrome flakes. Two du duochromes, two shimmers, one marbled shimmer and two mattes. So basically you get two mattes and then a whole bunch of sparkly goodness. That's, that's, that's what it is. The two mattes I think is a dark blue and a dark gray. Um, I think that you can create a lot of gorgeous things with this. It's not something that that speaks to me per se because I like more mattes than shimmers, um, but that's personal preference. Um, let me know your thoughts. Have you gotten this? Is it online already? Oh no, it's not online already. You cannot get this. So let me know. Are you excited? Are you excited for this? It will retail for say 50 bucks. Mm, there will probably be more. Products launching for them on Black Friday. I've never tried Notoriously Morbid. It is a brand that is interesting to me. They are doing interesting things. I just haven't seen anything that I'm like, yeah, that's going to be the one. But I do like the aesthetic. Notoriously Morbid. I love that, actually. Uh, let's go to the last thing that I have, which is from CXC Beauty. Uh, these are new single highlighters in eight shades. Uh, in the compact, they are 24. Uh, as single pants, they are 14. So if you have a compact, you know, you can just order uh, the shade itself. And that also means that they are refillable, which is always a good idea, I think, at least. Let's see the colors. Um... There are pretty colors here. There are. I have one of their bronzers and I really like the formula. I still want to get a lighter shade of bronzer because I have olive too. And that's a little bit too, um, too deep and too pigmented for what I like. Um, but there's also an olive one. So if you are olive, especially if you are in the USA, uh, go check out the brand because they have all of shades. They also have shades with red undertone. So they have four different undertones in uh, their bronzers uh, in alone. So go check them out anyway. Um, these look pretty. I would personally think I would go for Splendor. I think. Or Brilliance. Why? Because I like a warmer highlighter on me. Uh, I find that I find that more pleasing to the eye. But that's me though. Uh, but if you want a funky highlighter, they have it. So that is it for today. That's everything that I wanted to talk about. I'm still here at the site to give a special shout out to my members, which you will see scrolling on the screen right now. If you want to become a member, there is a link to join in the description box. And what do you get for being a member? You get a colored raven behind your name. And if you have a black raven, you are one of my OGs. You have been with us the longest. <laughs> you will also get special emojis to be used in the comment section and in live chat and there's also a members only video every first of the month and there's also a playlist uh, that you can uh, well watch if you are a member um, and if you are one of my members or you want to become one of my members if you have any ideas for the video for the first of december let me know down below your requests and i will write them down and then that is it yes let me go to the center <sighs> Uh, that was it. Next week is basically Black Friday is then the Friday. So it's Black Friday weekend, right? Um, yeah, that's it. It's going to be a normal makeup release, I think at least. Um, So what I will kind of try to do for next week is incorporate a little bit more of the Black Friday deals that are maybe still going on. You know, if I see some that are interesting, I will mention them as well. And if there are any brands that you are like, do they have Black Friday deals? 
go to their websites, go to their Facebook uh, pages, go to their Instagram pages to see if they have Black Friday sales because most of them will. Hell, we in the Netherlands don't celebrate uh, the, um, Thanksgiving. That was the word I was looking for. We don't celebrate Thanksgiving, but we still have Black Friday because, yeah, we like a deal. Don't we? So yeah, that's going to be it, guys. Thank you so, so much for watching. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down in the comment section below. I am going to wish you a fantastic day, a fabulous evening. May your foundation always match your neck. And I will see you very, very soon in my next one. Bye, guys. Mm -hmm.